so just wanted to uh, introduce you to Ivan Tadotov, um, our newest member of the Flyers. Um, he'll be on the ice uh, shortly after this. Um, so this is uh, pretty exciting for, for the Flyers to, to finally have him on board with, uh, with our team. Okay, this is something that's sort of been in the works for a long, long time, but can you take us through a little bit of the timeline recently here for when you were able to get Ivan over here and, and have a day like this? Yeah, not, not at the moment. Um, we want to focus on hockey for now. Uh, eventually, we'll get into that, but, uh, but for now, um, we'll just leave the, the details out. I mean, you were drafted almost nine years ago, and you've been through a lot. Can you just maybe describe the emotions you're feeling to, to arrive here? Yeah, sure. It's, uh, I've been here like a long time ago, around eight years. So it's uh, after that, it's, um, it's been a long time. So now I'm here, and for sure, yeah, I'm so excited and happy to be here. And uh, it's, you know, it's uh, great feelings because uh, really, really difficult, like two years. As for me, yeah, but yeah, now I'm here and happy, happy to be here and uh, I want to help the team like uh, struggle for the playoffs and be uh, one of the best team in playoffs, so uh, excited, happy and uh, I want to say, uh, I want to say uh, uh, thanks a lot to the organization, yeah, they support me and like, Everyone like um, uh, supporting, so that's it. Would you say it's a relief to you to be here now? Mm, relief? It's. Uh, does it feel good ah. to be here? No, no. It's uh, why well, uh, I'm feeling that really good. So it's uh, look forward and uh, for sure. Like now, it's mm. my career starting here, so I. I I hope it will be a long way and long road uh, together with Fede. So, like, mm, one more time, like, great feeling. So, like, Danny, you've had people watching Ivan. How would you break his play the last two seasons as far as his success on the ice? The last two seasons, well, the one year we didn't get to see him much um, for obvious reasons. And then, but this year we, we, we watch, we watch most of him, his games. Almost all of them, um, you know. What we felt was maybe there was a little rust at the beginning after not playing much hockey the first year, but uh, he was excellent in the second half of the season. He was excellent, uh, really took over in uh, in a playoff. He's very impressive uh, in his playoff series, so that um, you know makes it exciting uh, for us to bring him aboard. Dan, you see only eight games left, I think it is. Yeah. Will Ivan play? And you know, I know he's pending. Well, as far as the plane, plane um, you know how it works here. Uh, Torts is in charge of that. He'll be available. He'll be on the ice. He'll be with the team practicing. Um, and then, um, you know, the coaching staff will decide uh, if he plays or not. So uh, we're, we're excited, to, excited to have him here. Um, as far as the contract extension, it's something that we're, we're working on. I don't expect, I don't expect it to be a, an issue. Um, you know, but but nothing has been done uh, as of yet. And Felix is, is Felix still on the roster? No, or? no, Felix is uh, not on the roster. Um, that's where we had to get clarification from the NHL. Um, he is. Uh, he was on an emergency recall. Uh, so with adding Ivan to the roster, um, Felix had to report back to Lehigh Valley. Yeah, it's quite an, you know, it's, all these games are, are very important. Is it? Is there, is there, you know, Ivan, how do you feel jumping into the games where sure, these are very yeah. important games for the I know, team? Yeah, I know. It, yeah, it's, it's, it's a very important game for all organization, for guys. Yeah, it's for me too. So if uh, coach will have a decision, like, and give me a change of play, so I will play it for sure. So Danny, I'm sorry. Uh, you know how coincidental this looks. You guys are having, you're really up against it with goaltending. You didn't want to overwork Sam down the stretch. Um, what do you think about a little bit of backlash or verbal backlash you guys might hear here over this situation? 
from bringing in and making this happen at this time. Guys, just from from the rest of the landing place. From the rest of the landing place. As far as what, like looking into the situation and the way the lake has come to Okay, I, I, there, there's nothing wrong. I, I don't, I don't see why that would be a problem. We didn't do anything wrong. He was under contract, um, and uh, you know, before this season, before, for the last two years, and um, just reported now. So we added him to our roster. Um, nothing was done illegally, so. I, I don't see why it would be an issue. Um, I'm sure you have friends in the NHL. When you've spoken to them, who have, you know, goalies in the NHL, what have they told you the biggest adjustment has been for them coming over here as far as handling the pace of play, the traffic, the rebounds, versus what you experienced in, in Russia? Mm, yeah, uh, you're sure like everyone uh, knows players like really good to playing uh, in front of net like behind and uh, it's more uh, like some distractions and uh, more uh, scores like yeah. but you know it's mm, same thing for all gold is uh, in Russia you need to be you have to be mm, focused on the park like don't uh, think too much so it's uh, all goal is uh, with the uh, with the uh, I had uh, spoke I think talk so mm, not afraid be what you do usually so it's uh, and be focused follow the park follow the uh, rhythm game so it's of course a little bit uh, all here like it's more faster but it's you know it's for me it's really good I like it when the game is fast. It's possible, so it's. Uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. So. Amy, uh, how impressed have you been by Ivan's resolve? Just a seventh round draft pick in 2015, he's gone through a lot. Can you just speak yeah. to just what he's been through and how he's gotten here? Yeah, and that's what gives us confidence um, that that he can come and, and help us. He's been through a lot in his career. Uh, he's been a lot through uh, in his life, his personal life. Um, he, uh, he keeps fighting, um, he keeps getting better, keeps working in his craft. Um, so we're, yeah, it's a big part of the reason why we, we feel comfortable and we're, we're excited to have him aboard. Was there a clause in his AHL contract that allowed him to turn to over here? Uh, you know, that's, that's uh, between um, his team over there, um, you know, and his, his represent, representative. Um, I, I'm not aware of anything. Um, and, and you know, on our end, all we did was we, we got uh, followed the lead of the NHL, get clarification on what we were allowed to do and how we could do it. Um, you know, so everything was done properly on, on our end. Ivan, there's obviously been there's a, some very good Russian NHL goaltenders over here. Do you uh, know guys? Do you know Shostakin or Sorokin or any of those guys? And, and yeah, um, a little bit uh, Sorokin. Yeah, yeah, we know. I know him. Yeah. Uh, our coach, like uh, long time coaching us, so it's Sergey uh, Almo. So he good, uh, really good. Uh, know him. I am really good. Know him, like our coaching. So it's uh, eager. Mm, not we met early. Not, not met, met early. So, but Bobrovsky, yeah, I know a little bit him, like because sometimes he's living in St. Petersburg, it's my hometown, so it's, yeah, so now in the NHL, so many Russian goalies, it's, yeah, and Kachetkov, I know him, so, yeah. And did you ever maybe lose some hope that this would happen? Uh, I, know, <laughs> I know it's been quite a whirlwind, did you, did you ever think this it's might happen? It's been a long time, yeah, yeah, it's been a long time, um, you know, we were, we were always, I think, hopeful. Um, that he that he would come, uh, but yeah, it's it's been a long road. Um, you know, I, I give him a lot of props for um, to keep pushing and, and finally um, have the chance to come. And you know, hopefully, it's a, it's a new chapter for for him, and he gets to start his, his NHL career and it, you know goes off in the wrong on 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 the right foot. Sorry. Are you at all worried that there's you know, there's a big new 
even though the interim center looks like could be a, a little bit of a distraction for the guys here with eight games left. It's confusing. Well, I ho well. hopefully it's a little bit of a boost as well. Um, you know, we're, we're coming down the stretch sometimes. Uh, you know, you can't make trades anymore. Um, so hopefully it's uh, it's a little bit of a boost um, and gets uh, everybody gets excited and so we can finish strong and find a way to to get in the playoffs obviously that's the number one thing around here these days yeah. <clears throat> Has there been any conversation with Sam about bringing over and yes what his future looks like? yes we've been up front um, you know Sam was kept in the loop Felix was kept in the loop um, you know, we, we try to be as uh, open as we can with uh, with our players, um, and it was you know going to affect them. Um, you know, but at the same time, we we told Sam, you, you know, you've earned the rights to be the number one. We believe in you. We trust in you. Um, you know, but we we've been upfront with both, both of them. Well, we're we're just we're not going to get in the timeline at this time. Maybe we can talk about that uh, at a different time. Ivan, have you spoken to Sam at all yet? Not yet. Not yet. But yeah, we met each other like from development camp. A little bit, yeah. He remember me, I am too, so but not yet, we don't have talk. Just to clarify, if you guys get in the playoffs, I would be eligible to play in the Stanley Cup playoffs, correct? Correct. Okay. That's my understanding. That's what we got from the NHL, yes. One or two more? Ivan, where do you think the level of play is between KHL and here? Uh, for sure, yeah, it's uh, here, it's, uh, so many good players, uh, uh, level is higher, but in KHL, of course, uh, has uh, many players who are really good and can play here, but they they there, so, and uh, ahead this season, like, uh, so many good games when we uh, have to struggle with other team uh, who has uh, a lot of uh, really good uh, um, forwards. So it's, um, for example, like Karzani, plus it's Pachok, Gusev, like and so many other guys. So it's um, for me, it's a really really important thing. Like um, when every team have uh, has uh, like um, as much as possible good team uh, good players so it's uh, it's making you you better like you can be get better every day so it's uh, because for me uh, I want to get better every day so if I don't feeling uh, yourself comfortable and I don't feel like this um, so it's, it's bad I'm a little bit sad, so I should do a few. Last one. Do you, do you have you looked forward to the off season a little bit? Do you, do you want to stay in Philadelphia during the off season, and are you open to signing a contract extension with the team? Yes, for sure. Yeah, I'm open. So it's now a little bit focus uh, on the season. So and we'll see. Yeah, sure, sure. I'm here like for. I hope it will be a long time together. So. All right, uh, we're going to do a quick photo op. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thanks, Dan. How many guys going to the center? I'll ask him to bend down, maybe. <laughs> 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 Welcome to the Flyers. Thank you. 